2020 Bullet Premier 30 RIPR. This is the number one selling model on our lot. So they've added this brand new, a little bit more durable pec board. The 50 amp cord. This is a prep for second air conditioner. Nice slam latches. So you don't have to worry about twisting those knobs that always break. Magnetic catch. A little ice on there so it doesn't want to close quite like it should. Nice huge awning. Gives you a very good campsite to hang out and entertain. And speaking of entertainment, wait till you see this configuration. TV on a swivel mounted bracket. Gives you plenty of room to watch the game, the big race. Perfect for tailgating. Got a nice pull out prepping tray. Mini fridge puts uh, anything in there. Condiments, beers, beverages, you name it, it can go. This unit is equipped with the power stabilizer. So you simply push a button the back two jack go down push another button the front two go down it also is equipped with a propane line run from your tanks a lot of customers will add a bumper mounted grill that'll sing, sit here and swing on over so it gives you a nice cooking area where you can entertain spare tire with a nice cover on it keep the weather from dry rotting it you got the backup camera prep this is where your power connection is again 50 amp service one big slide that black square is your reefer vent this is going to be outside shower so this is pretty cool because it's actually hot water and cold water you got your sewer outlets you actually have two so you got one here it's going to be for your black and gray <clears throat> and the other is going to be for your gray um, just from the kitchen sink now this is where it gets pretty interesting so they've changed their design to where this is just like a fifth wheel. So you've got your battery disconnect, shut off all power inside the coach. Key TV, Keystone exclusive, their engineers came up with that. It's a simplified automatic uh, system for, for hooking up TV. All of your water connections, black tank flush so it helps move the solids along. And then you've got your power stabilizer controls which is awesome, it's a game changer. It's pretty neat because this cap comes out like so you can run your cords from the bottom up in you can latch your door and have everything hooked up don't have to worry about the kids at the campground messing with it this exact coach weighs unloaded vehicle weight 6940 6940 pounds and it can hold 8200 pounds this is a good size it's 35 feet again it's our number one selling layout nice front cap a little bit more aerodynamic nice paint job on it even though it's a little dirty LED lights let's check out the inside got the nice solid entry steps you've got the oversized grab handle bigger upgraded furnace and this sticker is telling you that it's got those power stabilizers so you don't have to worry about running jacks up and down manually by hand also they've changed your thermostat um, a lot better system than the medic Not that the medic was bad. I apologize for all the snow that you will see on the floor So stepping into the coach you get a nice hanging closet That's a vent tube for your gray tank here in the kitchen Look at this view. This is amazing. So dual posing slides gives you this nice massive island stainless steel sink and this is a retractable sprayer hose. Ton, a ton of drawers. Storage underneath the sink. You have plenty of storage over here beside your oven. Nice backsplash and a window beside it. And just a beautiful overall look. Some more storage with the nice glass with the finish, the woodworks. Very fitting for you campers. So this is the upgraded um, freestanding chairs. Standard is gonna be the booth dinette, which we have on our lot as well. We also get this nice light fixture. Just goes real well together with the color scheme and the glass on your cabinet doors. This also is an upgrade, so this is your theater seating. So those are nice recliners that will lay almost completely flat. So if you sleep in a recliner at home, 
you're going to feel right at home sleeping in this. Standard is going to be a trifold sofa. Speaking of trifold sofas, we got one right here. So this is going to sleep um, two people. The coach overall will sleep four. Get a nice glass on the uh, cabinet doors there. Nice big windows. I'd open them up, but it is very, very bright out and it would ruin the image here. So nice lighting up above the television and the glass there. In between the two is going to be your stereo which you have outside and inside speakers. Nice big TV on a swivel mount. And then you get a fireplace, which is pretty new. They've only been doing this for a couple of months now, and it's a total game changer. I would have it on, but I'm currently running just off of battery. I'm not actually plugged in. And then again, nice glass finish on your pantry. So this is very similar to a fifth wheel layout configuration in a travel trailer that is 35 feet long. You got the nice barreled ceiling that gives you six inches more of head height versus the flat line roof. You also get solid surface counters, so it's not any kind of press board or T molding edge that's going to crack and peel apart. Well, if you can kind of see, you can see the reflection off the lights that that is an actual Corian that's a good high grade, like a fifth wheel style. Oversized fridge, so it is still a gas and electric fridge and freezer, but it is uh, a couple cubic feet bigger than standard. Porcelain toilets, which is huge. Again, they're they're going after the fifth wheel look and uh, feel here. Nice finished medicine cabinet, plenty of storage. Nice shower with skylight slash fan. Let's check out the bedroom. So this is 50 amp service. So what that means is this is prepped for a second air conditioner. Does not have it, but you can see this sticker right here is telling you that the power source is right there. The framing, uh, the overall structure is meant for a second air. So with these new models, they also have made this storage a little bit deeper and added it in this drawer. And wait for this, this is genius. So on the back, You've got both USB chargers and outlets with a little grommet. So if you use a CPAP machine, you can run the wires up to that top shelf. Easy as can be. And that's the same on both sides. That white sticker you see on the wall and up above the two black rectangles, that's going to be your television prep. So there is a backer on the wall that you can screw into and put a swivel mount or some kind of television there. Nice barn style sliding door to the bathroom. And there you have it. Sorry again for all the snow. I'll clean that up here once I'm done. Thank you for watching. This is TRRV Sales in Elkhart, Indiana. Nobody gets a better deal.